Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jen. If you're new, welcome to another vlog. This is just going to be a day in my life vlog. I am on my way to get a drug test super randomly. So I've been looking for a job for a long time and finally I got a job, which is super exciting. I start next Monday. Today is Monday, May 17th. I start on the 24th, so a week from today. Um, and I just have to get a drug test. I already sent in like my background stuff. So I'm going to go do that now and then I'm going to go head to a coffee shop. I really want lunch. It's already kind of later. I really want lunch at this super cute place. They make really good avocado toast and then get some like computer stuff done there i need to finish my class this week like i've been talking about this for so long i've been working on this class for so long because it's like a self-paced class it's been taking me a while to get through it and that's just my own fault because i am procrastinating and i'm not getting it done but i really really need to finish it because i know that like when i start working a full-time job having class on top of that and then having YouTube on top of that, it's gonna be a lot to handle. And I just really prefer to have it done before then, or at least almost done, so that way I don't have to stress that much. So I'm gonna sit at the coffee shop for a little bit and hopefully get all of that done. But yeah, let's get our day started. The drug testing place is only like 10 minutes away. I'm hoping it doesn't take that long because it is just like first come, first serve. There's no appointments or anything. So I'm hoping it doesn't take that long, but we're gonna head there now and then hopefully go. back home coffee house went great i actually was pretty productive i was there for a couple hours it just started getting really really cold so i decided to come back home but basically what i'm working on is this course for people who are trying to do like social media stuff like that i think i've explained it before so this particular module is all about like editing how to use lightroom set up specific photos for different locations basically everything that has to do with taking photos for instagram how to edit them and stuff like that so i just finished like an hour and a half on the basics of lightroom and a little bit more of like presets and then i'm pretty sure the next module is all about like analytics instagram analytics and how to go into depth into that and like optimize your Instagram and all that good stuff so it's really really interesting um, I'm gonna take a little bit of a break I always end up spending so much money when I go to this place too because they have really good food like I mentioned I got the avocado toast but then I feel awkward sitting there like once I finished my first round of coffee so then I order another coffee and then by the time I like leave I've spent like $25 all on coffee in a span of like three hours but it's honestly all good that's like my favorite 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 place to go so I'm gonna finish working on my class for a little bit and then I have to go grocery shopping later and then I think I'm gonna work out after that. I think that'll be a nice break before I dive into more class. My goal is to finish it by the end of this week, but that just means that I have to work on it for literally like five hours a day because it is pretty lengthy. If you like want to take in the information and like practice information and take notes and all that stuff, so it is gonna be a pretty lengthy class day, but it's interesting and exciting and gonna help me get to where I want to go. So let's really jump. a little bit so I'm just gonna leave it for right now because I'm getting a little bit tired I'm gonna go pick up my sis from work and then I'll come back and work out I'll show you guys what workouts I've been doing lately I'm in love with my new little like routine sorry if this is annoying I'm finishing up my little peach ginger tea is actually really really good and a good alternative to getting a second dose of caffeine although I think it has a little bit of caffeine but enough talking I'm gonna go pick up my sister and then I'll catch up with you guys after that okay this is my little workout outfit this little top is from Amazon it's like that lululemon dupe and it's just in the gray color and then these are Gymshark leggings I don't really I have the matching like long sleeve top to this I don't really like wearing like the combo together because I feel like it like I don't know it's like too tight almost and it creates like this little suction right here where it's like not very flattering so I usually like, yeah, like to wear them like separately but on their own they're they're okay I think they're just like slightly too tight and I don't know if it's like the cut because the size is the same as like other Gymshark leggings that I have that fit me fine so I think it's just the cut but anyways this is it 
So basically what I've been doing lately as far as workouts is I'm still doing Lily Sabri. Um, I'm really in love with her workout. It's like mostly Pilates based, but she also does like cardio versus weights. I've talked to her a little bit before, but what I'm doing now is I'll do like one of her 30 minute either full body or like body part specific workouts. So like lower body or upper body. And then after that, I'll either run on the treadmill for like 30 minutes or I'll jump rope for like 20 minutes to get some cardio in. And that's been super, super fun for me to like mix it up. And I'm getting really good at jump rope finally. I think in my last vlog, I said that I really wanted to get good at it. And it takes a little bit of practice, but now it's like super fun. And I'm starting to do like the high knees and like, I want to learn how to do like the, what is it called? The like double around where you twist the jump rope around two times in one like hop. So it's just like really fun to like be trying something new and to like try to get good at something new. So I'm really enjoying that. So today I think I'm going to do lower body. I think I might throw it back today to like some Chloe Ting. I'm really feeling her energy, her type of workouts. And then I might do like a 10 minute finisher is what she calls them with Lily Sabri. And then I'll do jump rope after that. So I'm like feeling really energized and in the mood. And when I'm like in the mood to work out like this, I try to go as hard as I can because other days I like only have half of as much as energy. So my workouts aren't as good. So I'm in the mood today. So I feel like we're gonna have a really, really, really good workout. I'm still drinking the Alani New pre-workout in Hawaiian shaped ice. And to be honest, I don't know if it's really doing anything at this point because I have it every single day and I have a lot of caffeine every single day, but it still tastes good. And it still gives me like the tingly feeling, so I think it's doing something, but I don't know if it's like really pushing me to like go harder in my workout or anything like that. But it tastes good, so that's all that matters. And then I drink it in this little cute jar and I mix it with a straw because I lost my blender bottle. But I feel like this lighting in my house is the only lighting that's real also because this is like what I actually look like, like skin color wise. I'm like pretty tan and then in my room I look like so pale. Okay, we're done with my workout. I showered. I'm just doing some skincare and then I'm gonna go eat dinner. It's actually already like 8 30, but this is like usually the time I eat dinner. It's usually pretty late. Um, but I wanted to ask you guys if you guys have any recommendations because my hair, I did it with like the Dyson this morning and I showered last night so it was like pretty fresh and then obviously after my workout after like sweating a bunch it gets like super curly again so I was gonna ask if you guys have any like recommendations on how to keep your hair semi-decent after your workouts because I work out um on like a regular basis like maybe like five times a week but my hair never stays and I know some girls like their hair lasts for like six days and I just I want to know how so do you guys have any tips on how to keep your hair styled when you work out constantly let me know because it's literally like i didn't do anything at all and it's like huge and curly and i would like it to last a little bit longer so let me know if you have any tips this is my din salmon rice green beans this is where i'll be for the rest of the night we're gonna put on some New girl, this is my little makeshift TV setup <laughs> because since my closet is over there, I don't really have a place where I can like mount it. So I just get this little stool and I put it right here and it's honestly like the perfect height when I'm like sitting in bed. So I think I'm gonna put on some new girl and then finish up with some class that I still need to do for tonight to reach my little daily goal and FaceTime my boyfriend probably. I think I'm gonna end off the vlog right here. I'm literally just gonna watch Netflix and work on my class for the rest of the night. Basically the same thing that I've been doing all day. Next week will probably be more exciting because I'm starting my new job. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys for sticking around. I really appreciate it. More fun, interesting videos coming soon, but subscribe if you like this video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.